target of, uh, of a cyber attack from uh, the hacking group Anonymous. And uh, they were uh, upset, uh, if you will, about a particular patient case that uh, was uh, in the media. And uh, they took uh, issue with how the hospital was managing this patient's care and decided that uh, we should be targeted. Um, so really over the course of several weeks, we were, um, we were the subject of an attack uh, by Anonymous, primarily which consisted first of a denial of service attack, but then which uh, progressed to uh, outright efforts to penetrate our network um, and, uh, and um, solicit uh, patient data and uh, basically to make life miserable for us. It was all hands on deck uh, for several weeks there, both from an IT point of view as well as the organization at large because um, uh, it was a quite disruptive uh, set of events. So um, they uh, fortunately never quite made it inside or never were successful in accessing any data, which I'm thankful for. But nonetheless, it was a disruptive uh, set of events. Basically, I said holy smokes or a derivative of that uh, <laughs> phrase. Um, but I was somewhat shocked. You know, clearly this patient case had been in the news and, and I knew it was a subject of quite a bit of attention. But I didn't think that uh, a hacktivist group uh, to the degree of anonymous uh, would be paying attention to this kind of thing. So it definitely was a surprise uh, and not a nice surprise. Uh, far and away, the, the biggest uh, lesson learned from this is that, in general, cybersecurity is a thing that, um, that, as a single provider institution, but frankly, as an industry, we need to take more seriously. Um, these threats are real, uh, as I can tell you uh, now from our, our uh, experience, not just from the point of view of potentially uh, breaching and accessing data for various purposes, but also um, just with respect to being disruptive to clinical operations. Um, so I think for this, it was an enormous wake-up call, uh, personally and, as I said, as an industry.